Okay, hello and welcome to my first Minecraft tutorial. Uh, today I'm going to teach you how to make a very simple um, minecart wave machine. Um, for those of you that don't quite know what a minecart wave machine is, uh, you will in a minute. Um, okay, so this is, like I said, the most basic design um, possible for a wave machine. Um, I've not had a lot of experience with redstone before. Um, so I'm, I, I kind of count myself as a novice. So first of all we're going to start by laying eight blocks of wool. Okay, like so. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then we're going to count nine blocks across. So one, two, and in fact we'll put the tracks down. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And we're going to do that all the way along. This is what our minecarts will be going up and down. Now the reason we're doing it eight along is um, mainly for time constraints because obviously building a big one will take a lot of time but also because eight is the maximum distance that uh, redstone will travel without having to put another energy source in. Okay so once we've done that I'm going to go back along with the red wool. Uh, you can use any material you, you want. Uh, I'm just using red wool because it's a nice colour. Um, okay, so once we've got this, we need to lay down our uh, redstone repeaters. Now, the idea is is that we put one all the way along here. Now, each of these are going to be on the default setting. Now, the idea is that each one along goes one tick more than before. So this one will be on one, right click to put that one on two, double click to put that one on three, triple click to put that on one on four, and then we start again. But obviously we're going to need another one to add on the fifth. So do that for each of these. So one, two, three, four, and that one's on the fifth. One, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, oh, four, and then down to there. Okay, so we've got our basic layout. Um, now all we need to do is hook them up. So just a piece of redstone in between each of these to hook them up. Come down to here, then along here. Okay, now that they're all hooked up, we can place our lever down, which goes just here. And now for the minecarts, which I've forgotten to put in my inventory. Now make sure that you don't do what I've done. If you accidentally throw something down onto a train track, the minecart will be stopped by it. So make sure that there's nothing on the track. Okay, we're going to place a minecart on each of these. And with any luck, this should work. <clears throat> okay, so flick the switch, and as you can see, the minecarts will go backwards and forwards, backwards and forwards in a wave formation, um, which is quite odd to look at because curves aren't that often in Minecraft. Um, now, what we can do here to create another circuit again to make a longer track is simply put more redstone repeaters down. Now this one has to face this way. God knows why, but it just does. Um, we then need some more blocks. Uh, redstone, redstone, up like that. <coughs> Another redstone repeater set to there. Um, redstone and then you simply just do the same the same again and as you can see when I eventually stop them 
they all go off. And when I start them again, it works. Okay, um, I hope that uh, explains how to make it. If not, just pop me a comment in the boxes below. Um, and don't forget to subscribe.